Holly Morgan going off. Matthew Tate comes on. And Ireland have this throw that close to the goal line. O'Connell is the target. Safely taken. On comes the drive. Looks pretty good. Ireland through the middle. Not quite there yet. It's coming back though. Stringer. Stringer goes on his own. It's gone loose. Brilliantly Great offloaded. Hands. Great try for Ireland. Fantastic work. Dervin Dempsey finishes it. Slight of hand. Power by the forwards. Great combination work against the 14 man England. I thought just for a second that they might have told that because Stringer half coming. I thought they closed it down there with great hands in the middle. Always went outside with whether they could get there. I just thought that dart may have closed it all down with a poor pass, but that's a lovely sleight of hand. It was a simple finish by Gervin Dempsey, but what about this? Darcy and Driscoll picking it up on the half volley. Good ball from Darcy. And well, Ireland, I think Ireland will feel quite comfortable now. They've had the better of the last 15 minutes. They've started to get into England's line-out. England have not been able to get themselves out of their own half. Now they're a man down. Agar is kicking well. The first try has gone to Ireland. They should be very happy. Two points added. Ireland 16, England 3, and suddenly the complexion of the game has changed completely. Brian O'Driscoll's pass and Gervin Dempsey's finish. Well, there were two bits of good handling there. One, that Darcy was the one that picked the half volley off Stringer, and then O'Driscoll picked the half volley off Darcy.